I'm Anastasia from Texas News and this is your Week in Tech. Today we're at Launchpad Labs, a brand new business incubator in Old Street. Here's co-founder David Hardman to tell you more. Launchpad Labs is a registered charity. We're here to help early stage entrepreneurs with workspace mentoring and financial guidance and we're filling up fast. It's time to silence the critics as a report this week announced that technology will make up 12% of our economy by 2016. This means tech will overtake our manufacturing sector, which is currently worth 11%, and will be biting at the heels of financial services at 14% of GDP. The report was part of a tech manifesto by Policy Exchange, who want Britain to be the best place for startups outside Silicon Valley. It's been a big week for Apple announcing they'll accept Bitcoin in their app store, and we got a first look at iOS 8 at the Worldwide Developer Conference. Key announcements include iOS 8's new focus on smart home devices, you can now finally choose your own keyboard, and iMessage will be getting a makeover Snapchat style. Users will soon be able to send pictures and videos, which will expire in two minutes. Sadly, the biggest news was the lack of actual news. No iPhone, no iWatch, leaving a lot of people wondering whether Apple is still cool. Check out Mick Wright's column on Tech City News to see if you agree. Meet Pepper, the Japanese robot of the future, and the first to understand human emotions. The best news is the price. You'll be able to pick up your very own Pepper for just £1,000 next year. Customers can get a first glimpse of Pepper as SoftBank are rolling out the robots across their stores today. Our download of the week is set to take on the likes of Halo and Uber with its cab comparison service that promises the best prices and great service. Minicabster is a London-based startup that compares quotes for 10,000 cabs in London. You say where you want to go, pick a time, and the app offers up the best price cab, along with customer ratings. The app works similar to Uber in that you can pay by card, use your GPS location, and it sends you the information of your driver. It's easy, intuitive, and free to download now on iOS and Android. And finally, the Power of Online video captured the perfect moment at a wedding this week. Here's the entire bridal party posing for that perfect picture until they all fell into a lake. Needless to say, the video went viral. This has been your Week in Tech. For more, check out Tech City News and follow us on Twitter.